And thank you. A man being called a co-conspirator of Alec Murdoch's is now facing charges of his own and could end up in jail just like Murdoch himself. WSAV News 3's Andrew Davis is digging deeper into the latest indictments. He joins us live from our Low Country newsroom. 44 pages, four new charges against Alec Murdoch and 18 charges against Corey Fleming. That indictment by a Beaufort County grand jury states that Murdoch recommended his good friend to be the lawyer for the Satterfield family and then together they allegedly stole millions in insurance money. It's the first time Fleming has been charged, but Alec Murdoch's own lawyers have brought up his involvement before. Land and those guys have already settled the case with Corey Fleming. They're beat. Go, go your, I mean, it's just, it, it's amazing to us uh, that, that the focus is on just Alec. There are other people uh, who are participating in this process. And apparently that grand jury was listening. Fleming now facing charges ranging from money laundering to computer crimes, criminal conspiracy, making false statements, and breach of trust, all stemming from the alleged scheme to steal more than $4 million in insurance money from the Satterfield family after Gloria Satterfield died in an apparent accident at the Murdoch's home in 2018. Alec has already been indicted for stealing money from her sons. This new indictment says Fleming also took part in the fraud, using the insurance money meant for Satterfields to pay for his own mortgage and, quote, his large credit card debt. Now, Fleming has previously denied he was involved in any sort of conspiracy, saying his close friend Murdoch misled and deceived him. Murdoch now faces a total of 75 charges for defrauding his clients and others of more than $8 million. He remains in the Richland County Jail. Clory Fleming will have a virtual bond hearing tomorrow morning. Andrew Davis, WSAV News 3, on your side. Thank you, Andrew.